Hey guys, so today's video is going to be on five Cricut projects that's going to make you money. This is a collaboration with YouTuber Do Dream On, so I will include her portion of her video down below in the description. But if you want to know the five projects that have been able to make me thousands of dollars, make sure you stay tuned. So before I get into the Cricut projects that I want to share today, I do want to say before I decided to actually invest in a Cricut machine, I honestly didn't know too much about what it can do. From a lot of the videos I saw online, I saw that most people were just cutting out paper. But as time progressed and I took the time to really invest in learning as to what this machine can do, I thought it was a great investment. So I decided to buy one during the time when we were all stuck in the house. I was thinking to myself, I bought this machine and a lot of people are losing their jobs and there's no stream of income really coming in for a lot of businesses. What can I do with this machine knowing that there's a need for something? So I decided my first project would be a custom face mask. There was tons of face masks out there at the time and at one point we did have a shortage. But what I noticed that people wanted were custom face masks. So I decided to take my Cricut, buy some vinyl and do logos and designs on those face masks. The moment that I decided to put it out, I made over a thousand dollars within the first week. Believe it or not, there's still a lot of ways to generate some income with the mask. If you know people who are getting married, a lot of them still want custom face masks for those type of events even for birthday parties and even for special occasions like red carpet events. If you're thinking of ways to sell it online, there are a ton of different marketplaces that I was on that helped me with my sale. Now I do have my own website. However, I was on Facebook Marketplace, Poshmark and Etsy. Those were my top three marketplaces to be on to sell my face mask and it did wonders for me. So for Cricut project number two, I created custom canvases. You may have seen my YouTube tutorial where I created a custom Ariana Grande canvas using permanent vinyl. You can check that out. I'll have that video right here on the side. But in that video, you can buy a canvas from Dollar Tree. You can buy it from Michaels and or Joann's or Hobby Lobby. So it's not a big startup cost to create that, right? All you have to do is buy a canvas, make sure that the price of your canvas is not too much. I spent at least less than $3 for my canvas. And then for the vinyl, I got some of it from Dollar Tree. So check that out. There's different types of projects that you can create if you decide to do a custom canvas. Uh, for me, I did something that was just more so black and white with the silhouette of Ariana Grande. Very simple, yet very chic, where it can be mounted up in somebody's home for their decor in their house, right? But then we also have people who do paint and sips and all types of paint parties. And this is where you can use your vinyl, place it like a design on the blank canvas and sell it to people for paint parties and turn it into a whole business. There's a lot of different things that you can do with that. You can decide what sizes you wanna sell and then kind of go from there. Now, anytime you're starting to sell things to people, always make sure that you have a cost sheet. If you do not know what that is, it's basically a sheet that has the cost of everything that you're spending for the money that will be put into this new business idea or this thing that you are going to sell. Because you always wanna know what the profit will be when you are selling so that you're not just selling stuff and not making any money. Another great project that has made me tons of money are my custom coffee mugs. You may have seen my projects here on YouTube where I show you how to make custom coffee mugs in different ways. Now, technically, you don't really need a Cricut machine to create the custom mugs. However, by having a Cricut machine, it will make your life so much easier and allow you to get the projects done a lot quicker, especially when it comes to cutting very detailed design. I will include a link for the tutorial down below in the description and on this video right here. But the moment I decided to share my custom mug, people were going crazy. Initially, I didn't have any intentions on selling the mugs, but due to all the demand of people asking me for the mug, I decided why not? So the first week of me selling my custom mug, I made about $500 selling them at about $12 each. As time progressed, I made over $5,000 within 30 days. And then the following month, 10 grand. 
the platforms that I was using to sell my custom coffee mugs was Facebook Marketplace, my own website, Instagram, and Etsy. You can do all different types of design. The only thing I will add is that if you're using designs from online, make sure that you have rights to it by reaching out to the artist or paying for the artwork through the artist. So for Cricut project number four, we have t-shirts. This is perhaps really popular for a lot of people who have a Cricut machine. If you haven't checked out my video here on my YouTube channel, I showed the behind the scene process of me creating a t-shirt with my Cricut machine using heat transfer vinyl. The moment I shared my t-shirts, I got tons of individuals and other companies that wanted custom shirts as well. So for my own business, I'm bringing in about a thousand to two thousand dollars a month. For other businesses, I'm bringing in an extra grand, which helps a lot. So what I do when companies are reaching out, I do a bundle deal where I'm able to create something for them and a few other coworkers. So it's not like I'm creating thousands of t-shirts. I'm only one person and unfortunately I can't, right? But there's a lot of companies that are looking for just like 10 shirts for a special occasion and so forth. You can even create this for friends and family, especially for special events like birthdays or family reunions. Last but not least, we have custom cards. You may have seen my YouTube video that I did with YouTuber Do Dream On, where we showed you guys how to make custom cards. Now, the moment that I made that video, I just did a whole bunch of random ones just to practice. But my brother, being the entrepreneur that he is, decided he was gonna sell them to make a profit and use the money for his own business. And believe it or not, he sold out in a matter of minutes. And I think the great thing about making those custom cards is if you are creating the entire design, especially on the Cricut machine, everything is original, it's not something that can be bought in stores. So there's a lot of people who are buying those cards that were using them for birthday parties, wedding invitations, pop-up shops invitations, and also dinner party. So just start thinking about who you're trying to target and then create cards around that niche. That is what made it easier for me as I was creating more cards for my brother. There's all these different ways that you guys can make money and all the tutorials are here on my YouTube channel. So you definitely wanna check them out. And once again, if you decide that you wanna start really selling and diving deep into entrepreneurship, make sure you have your cost sheet. I will have a link down for you below if you wanna check that out and get a download. Other than that, thank you all for watching. I have so many great videos coming up for you guys, so make sure you turn on your bell so you do not miss an upload.